Hi, uh, I'm Steve Stanswick, a professor in CIS. One of the most beautiful ideas in all of computer science and mathematics, and one that's inspired my own research, is that in a deep technical sense, um, proofs and programs are the same. What that means is there's a fundamental connection between the structure of the code that's running in my iPhone and the structure of those step-by-step -step logical deductions you did in high school geometry or in CIS 160. And I love this idea because it grew out of a struggle um, from about 100 years ago when Russell's paradox poked a hole in the attempts to formalize mathematics. And the fix for Russell's paradox was uh, type theory. And it connects to some of the most uh, deep mathematical results that we know, such as Gödel's incompleteness theorem. But what does any of that have to do with engineering? Well, it turns out there are some really practical uses. So, Today, this idea shows up in the design of modern languages like Java, Swift, and Scala, which are used by software engineers to build all of the apps and web services that we can't live without. And so these types help software engineers structure their code and catch bugs, but they can do more. That correspondence between logic on one side and programs has led to proof assistance, these tools that can help us engineer proofs at amazing scale. Uh, tens of thousands or millions of steps of reasoning. And what's that good for? Well, we can now verify actual software, ruling out bugs and making them less vulnerable to attacks or failure. So I and my colleagues are working toward the science of deep specification, which aims to make this kind of verification routine. So we imagine that safety critical programs like your robotic car or the code in your pacemaker are built hand in hand with proofs that they're correct. Um, and these proofs are machine checked. So we imagine a future where not only do we have software engineers, but we have proof engineers that work side by side with them to help us build more secure, more reliable, and more robust code. And it's all thanks to this beautiful symmetry between proofs and programs. Thanks.